So if you've been watching the news today, you know the big story out there is the uh, mega blizzard that is hitting the East Coast, shutting down uh, cities like uh, New York, Baltimore, and even the capital, Washington, D.C. Now some people are calling this Snowzilla, some people are calling it Snow Again, and some people are referring to it as Winter Storm Jonas. Yeah, you, you look it up and you'll see Jonas Blizzard, Winter Storm Jonas, and you're asking yourself, what, we're naming blizzards now? When did that start? Well, that started in uh, 2012 with the Weather Channel. Apparently, the ratings weren't too good. I don't see how that's possible. I mean, it's it's the Winter Channel. I mean, doesn't everyone watch it when they're going to go somewhere? It's like, I'm going to the park. Check the Weather Channel. Find out what the weather's going to be like. Taking a trip? Check the Weather Channel. Find out what the weather's going to be like. How the hell are they not getting ratings? Well, anyway... Some of them geniuses decided that they should probably start naming these big winter storms. And they enlisted the help of the Bozeman High Latin Club of Bozeman, Montana. You know, getting some millennials to help them come up with some snazzy names for these uh, winter storms so they can uh, get the ratings they wanted. Everyone would be talking about, you know, Winter Storm Jonas or Super Sandy. So, I'm thinking, you know... There's probably going to be another big-ass winter storm in our lifetime. Maybe next year, maybe two years down the line. Why not uh, come up with some names for that one? And uh, here we go. First one, Winter Storm Belly. See what I did there? How about uh, Superstorm Tanya? Why Tanya? Well, have you ever met a Tanya who was uh, nice and pleasant? I don't think so. Okay, one of the ones that these uh, little millennials out of Montana came up with was going to be YOLO. They want to call it Winter Storm YOLO. Wow. Okay. How about Winter Storm WTF? Because, you know, what the fuck? You want to get uh, a lot of people on social media talking about it? Why don't we just call it a uh, hashtag snowstorm so white? I can see Spike Lee and uh, Jada Pinkett Smith getting behind that one. How about a uh, superstorm electric boogaloo? How about a uh, mega blizzard? Sea salted caramel truffle. You know, if you're going to just pour yourself out for ratings, you might as well get some cross promotion in with DQ. Name the uh, Mega Blizzards after their blizzards. You could have Mega Blizzard uh, Brownie Batter, Mega Blizzard Chocolate Extreme, Mega Blizzard Cherry Mocha Madness. Think about it. Now, they say... Mm. Now, they say with these uh, names, they wanted something that was short, pronounceable, and would work good with a social media hatch, hashtag. Let's screw that. Let's go with Superstorm Hippo Pato Monstros Sequip Daliophobia. If you want to get people off the streets into safety, you got to quit naming them all these little nice names like Bob and Keith and Stu. You got to go with something that makes people say, oh, crap, I don't want to mess around. That's why I'm thinking Superstorm Satan. And speaking of the Dark Prince, why don't we uh, name one after his underlings? And they have uh, Winter Storm One Direction. Because I know those guys are always on social media. People are talking about them. They're like, oh, Harry's got a new hat. And Niles has just gotten shortened his nails. They're always hashtagging. It's like, we can name the next one uh, Winter Storm 365 since days since Zane left. That'd get the word out. <laughs> 